Mario! What is up my friends? Welcome to my beautiful hotel room here in Vienna. I just had an awkward situation where I got back from a press event for Vienna Pride and they wanted to take some pictures of me. And guys, I've taken a lot of pictures in my modeling career, but sometimes I just feel a little bit awkward because I didn't want to put on my blue steel modeling look because then I feel like an arrogant douchebag. But I also didn't want to smile because when I laugh in pictures, I look like a psychopath who's about to murder somebody. And guys, let's face it, you have been feeling the same way. That's why you clicked on this goddamn video and that's why I'm gonna show you the top seven male model secrets that I use. <coughs> <coughs> I'm definitely gonna cut that out. Like and subscribe, buy my merch. Let's get started. So this is a very powerful tip in general for modeling. You don't wanna have your chin too close to your body. You always want to imagine that you are sucking on a cocktail, right? You're sucking on a straw, but somebody's slowly pulling the drink away from you. So your chin is always up. You're leading with the chin. This gives you a stronger jawline and makes you look more thin and more athletic and just better in general. Then you want to personalize the camera. So look at this. If I look at the camera right now and it's a black camera, it's kind of intimidating, right? I look kind of awkward. I feel awkward, but now I'm gonna imagine that inside the camera my mom's looking at me And if I see the eyes of my mom, I kind of feel I kind of <laughs> I miss you mom <laughs> You so much. Don't pick your mom if you miss her. If you're alone in a hotel room in Vienna right now, pick somebody you maybe want to seduce, somebody who makes you laugh, somebody who makes you feel comfortable. You look at that person, they're looking at you, you see how my energy is changing already. And if you have a purpose like that, you want to seduce somebody, you're kind of sending signals with your eyes. You can literally say, I want to f you, but don't say it because that'd be awkward, but do it with your eyes. Just say, <laughs> you get the idea, right? Just personalize the camera, make it your own, and that's how you're gonna kill it in photo shoots. And next up, you wanna just loosen up because the one thing that shows in pictures that looks awkward as hell is you being tense. And you can get rid of tension by just getting all your energy out and doing things like this. Oh, oh, meow. Loosen up your mouth. <laughs> 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 It's me, Mario! Definitely don't do this in public, you know, if there's a lot of people around, you still want to be friends with them, but vocalize it, talk to somebody before, kind of get your energy out there, maybe dance a little bit, that's gonna make you look way more relaxed. All right, then next up we're gonna talk about angles, because angles can literally change everything about your face. You can look chiseled like a Greek god, or you can have a weird double chin. So what I recommend you do is get out your phone and play with different angles, kind of get the low angle, a higher angle that really showcases your beautiful eyes, a strong side angle that really shows off your jawline and your chin and that's how you're gonna find your best angle and your chocolate side for me personally for example I always try to angle my body away from the camera my shoulder like this and then look back at the camera that's how I'm gonna create this elongated jawline just looks more masculine looks more manly but if you're more of a if you have these like beautiful blowjob eyes I mean this in a good way then you maybe want to kind of look up Aww. then of course you want to be lit by a source of light that's preferably very bright because if you're inside a room it looks like this your pictures are not gonna look good you definitely want to avoid this kind of yellowish indoor lighting because it's just gonna make your skin look awful what you want to have is either natural light coming from a window like this one right here but it's 11 p.m. right now so instead I have this beautiful ring light it's an LED that just Holy makes everything look beautiful. My skin looks flawless right now. That is not the case. That is literally just because I'm using this gigantic ring light. So make sure you have an even source of lighting. And one more pro tip is to wear something dark. Because if you wear something dark, the light that comes from the light source is not gonna bounce off your shirt. So you're gonna have a shadow underneath your chin that's gonna make your jawline more chiseled. You're gonna look better. Girls are gonna love you. Guys are gonna love you. Dogs are gonna love you and you're just gonna kill Kill it. I mean, not the dogs, but you're gonna kill it at your photo shoot. Oh God, 
I'm, I'm full of puns today. Fuck yeah. That next up, you always want to keep moving because when I first started my modeling career, I felt so scared when I was on set. I was kind of stiff. I didn't know what to do. But once I started moving from one pose to another, the best shots were always taken in between movements. For example, if you're taking a shot outside of your outfit or something, just make a little step back and forth. I mean, you obviously don't want to be exaggerating this, but just a slight movement with your head is enough. Just like always keep moving your face because while you're in movement, you don't think about looking awkward because the thing is, once you think about looking awkward, I guarantee that's when you look awkward. But when you're in movement, you kind of have a purpose. You move, you can also touch your shoulder. Those are the moments that are fluid, that are natural, where everything just comes together for the perfect shot. Then the one thing I've been struggling with the most personally is having a genuine laugh because at photo shoots, a lot of times at castings, they ask me, hey Mario, can you smile or laugh for us? And then I go like, sure. <laughs> and I look at the camera and I'm suffering internally because I'm so nervous, but I'm still trying to laugh and I just look like a freaking serial killer. But one thing that works magically is always to laugh and go into a full laugh, but do it off camera. <laughs> You take that energy and you look back at the camera and you're a bit more relaxed. And that is when you smile, when you have that little smile, that little hint of positivity in your eyes without going to a full serial killer laugh. And I look cute, I actually look cute. And you can look cute too and I want you to look cute, so try it out. Okay, and then once you've done all of that, you wanna get out of your phone and edit the shit out of your pictures. You can start light on Instagram by just using the Instagram Paris filter. That's a beautiful one. It just adds a little bit more coolness and just add a little bit more snoo smooth, uh, 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 more smoothness to your skin. Then as the next level, you can also use the subtle filter on Instagram. That's just gonna make your skin look flawless. Then one level above that, you have the bunny or the dog filters. Or if you wanna take it to the next level, you can also use one of these Korean beauty apps or Facetune where you can literally make your face slimmer, make your eyes bigger, and even give yourself a fake smile. It is literally the creepiest shit I've ever seen, but a good middle ground is actually using an app called Snapseed where you can just give yourself a little bit more smoothness in the face. I also made a full tutorial. Check it down below where I show you how you can edit your own modeling pictures. And right now I want your opinion because I've been doing more vlogs, more crazy experiments, but I haven't done a video like this where I actually give some tips or some how-to stuff in a while. So let me know what kind of videos you enjoy more, if you enjoy these videos more. Like this video, subscribe to my channel because after this I'm gonna go to London. I'm gonna do some crazy shit all around the world. So love you guys. Always keep smiling. Always Follow your impulse, Mario out, carrot drop. I've been flying from town to town.